Hey everyone, so I am making this video because I heard word of something YouTube is going to be implementing that, yeah, this is going to be bad for people who are both using YouTube to figure something out. This is going to be bad for people who use it as a source of entertainment. This is going to be bad for us YouTubers, and it's going to blow up in their face. Because even people who don't use YouTube much are going to suffer when they actually need YouTube. So what are they doing? They are going to be, at least this is what I hear is going to happen. They're going to be implementing a system where you can only watch channels you are subscribed to. What this means is... Say you're going on YouTube for a tutorial, okay? You don't watch a lot of tutorials, so you wouldn't be subscribed to anyone. Nope, you can't do it. it. You won't be able to. Unless they're in your subscriptions, you will not be able to watch them. This hurts YouTubers because new people can't find our channels. And that hurts people who use it as a source of entertainment and people who use it to learn something as well. Because if you can't watch channels you're not subscribed to, that makes it almost impossible to use YouTube as a resource. And it makes it almost impossible to use it as a source of entertainment. This is going to blow up in their face. Okay? Nobody is going to accept this. And I guarantee you it will not last very long. Because if it does, YouTube is intentionally digging their own grave. Because if you do this, basically, the only people who wouldn't be affected is People who already have like 25,000 subscribers or more. People who have huge followings already and they wouldn't even really notice. But when they go to watch stuff on YouTube, they would notice. This, has, this is a stupid thing, which I, even though it's not, I can't really say it's confirmed, someone... I trust is who I heard this from. So I'm pretty confident this is reliable information. And if it is, that's actually a bad thing. Um, what I'm hoping is that this person heard it wrong in all of this. But anyways, this is going to blow up in YouTube's face. And if they want to stay in business, they're going to need to stop it quickly. On top of this, they're already doing things that are kind of putting them under. Um, they're pretty much turning YouTubers from people who they make their money off of and the people they're making it impossible to make them money already. And now they're doing this. YouTube, are you literally trying to go out of business? Because that's what it's starting to feel like. Um, I haven't met one YouTuber who is all terribly thrilled with what they're doing already. But this on top of it is just kind of ridiculous. And all we YouTubers can do is hope they catch on pretty quickly. And I'm going to send feedback, as I suggest all of you do once this is implemented, to say this is not cool. That's about all we can do to get it changed back. Uh, I don't know when exactly this is going to happen, but it won't be hard to figure it out when it does. And once it does, I suggest all of you 
uh, go to sen submit feedback to YouTube telling them this was the wrong move. Because, just because I'm not trying to attack YouTube or anything, but this is more of a warning video. I'm trying to warn you that all this is going to happen. Uh, all I can do is hope that if we all send negative feedback about it to YouTube, maybe we can get them to realize this was the wrong call. That's about all we can do. I mean, my channel has been stuck in the 100 subscriber count for a couple years now. I can't really understand it. Maybe it's because my video quality is war is not that great. But I can't really do anything about that. And my viewer count hasn't been that great either. I don't know why people are having trouble finding my channel. But now this hurts me a lot, okay? Because I'm trying to spread a message. To make real change. And so far it seems like YouTube has something against that. Clearly the algorithm doesn't like me. Because people aren't really finding my channel. And I'm not just basing that off of subscribers. But viewers as well. I don't have a lot of viewers on any video. I am... Um, they've made it a nightmare just to upload... I have had problems with the whole COPPA system. Basically, ever since COPPA started, YouTube hasn't done one bloody thing correctly. And it's ridiculous. It, it needs to stop, YouTube. If you want to stay in business, you need to fix your actions before you put yourselves under. Because the more you turn people away from YouTube. Both people who watch it. And people who make the content alike. The less money you're going to make. And if this keeps up. You're not going to be able to stay in business. These actions that you have been doing since COPPA started have only been digging the hole deeper. And at this rate, soon, it will not be something you can come back from. So, you might want to rethink how you're addressing this. This is more me trying to warn everyone using the site and let you know what's really happening. Honestly, I like that there's no more dislike button. Because it would hurt people's uh, presence in the algorithm for the same exact thing a comment could do. And it's irreversible. Also, I can't tell you how many times I've accidentally hit dislike when I meant to hit like. And even though you can undislike something, it was a problem for me and people I watched. Uh, I'm honestly glad the dislike button is gone. But other than that, I don't think YouTube is done too much that's all that great since COPPA started, really. Ever since COPPA was implemented, YouTube has been a downhill spiral, uh, which COPPA is the Children's Online Privacy and Protection Act, which is when the whole age restriction crap started and YouTubers had to start marking their videos for kids or not for kids. 
and they gave no incentive for people to mark anything as for kids. They have misjudged things that would qualify as not for kids. Like, I remember that happening to a Neo video I made. If you know what Neo is, you know that's ridiculous. So, yeah, um, it needs to stop, YouTube. I, normally, I wouldn't make this kind of video, but this is not an acceptable change in any sort of way. You have made bad calls since COPPA has started, but this, this is over the line, stupid. I'm not trying to attack anyone here or anything, but it needs to be brought to light just how ridiculous of an idea this is. And it either YouTube isn't going to last much longer or this is going to be reversed. I'm telling you that's going to be the case because there's no way this is possibly going to be a good thing. And I don't even know what reasoning someone could have possibly had for doing this. Anyways, I have rambled on. Probably gotten a little more aggressive than I should have. I'm going to end the video here. I hope you take what I said to heart. Because this is going to affect everyone. No matter how much you use YouTube, everyone uses YouTube to some degree. Even if it's just you don't know how to use something. Because it's the premier way to make tutorials and the premier place to find them. But that could change now. That could all go out the window now. So yeah, I'm going to end it there. This is all bad. No good, really. And it should... Hopefully it doesn't last very long. That's all I can say.